A sport in Central Park. It's been played in the heart of the park for nearly a century, and but it's something New Yorkers don't even know exists. CBS 2's Emily Smith shows us what lawn bowling is all about. Tour guides and pedicab drivers have been known for telling folks that the New York Lawn Bowling Club is an exclusive clique for millionaires, but really, it's open to anyone. Off of West 69th Street in Central Park, you find a bowling green, which by definition is a finely laid stretch of lawn for bowling. It's been around for about 90 years in New York City, yet it's referred to by its 100 members as the best kept secret in New York. I think Central Park has an oasis here that no, not many people know about. Ryan Hostu is the vice president of the Central Park New York Lawn Bowling Club. For attire, he says weekend tournament members wear white. During the week, there's no dress code. For equipment, you use a roughly three and a half pound bowl supplied by the club if you don't happen to have your own set of four. Before you bowl, you roll the white ball known as a jack to mark the spot. To roll the bowl properly, you need a combination of finesse and speed. I gave it a try, clearly falling short of the jack. In the end, it's about who's closest to the jack, a game with more similarities to bocce than bowling. You don't even have to be a bowler or a sports enthusiast or even a sports player. I, I, before I joined this club seven, nine years ago, I'd never played a sport in my life. So next time you're walking through Central Park, peek over the fence. Will they teach you how? They'll teach you how. Oh, look at that. I had no idea. It's been here since 1926. Really? Yeah. It's an old sport, but not necessarily an old person sport, suitable for most anyone looking for a genteel experience in Central Park. Emily Smith, CBS 2 News. And to join the New York Lawn Bowling Club, it cost $105 for the season, which runs through October uh, and includes a clubhouse locker.